is Morning Express. You are watching on this 17th day of July 2015. Great that you're here with us. And now we'd like to look at the Pulse and the Nairobi. And just in case you didn't know, the Pulse is in the Standard. So make sure you get yourself a copy of the Standard. And uh, so long. Yes. What do we have in the Pulse? Today? First of all, look at this uh, brief girl on the page, on the front page, and as always. Yeah. Oh, the front page. Victoria and Joki. You, the diva. Oh, I love the red. I love the red. I love the red. But of course, the red. Two thumbs up for the red. Two thumbs up for the red. I'm not sure it's the red, but anyway, there you go. That's your story. But of course, you know, you can always grab a picture of a very nice hot girl on the pulse every Friday. You know, and the pulse has covered a lot of things that happened over the weekend. There was a lot of activity over this weekend, you know, mm -hmm. from uh, Daddy Owen's launch um, um, to, to the launch of uh, Miss, Miss World Kenya is, is also back, you know, and they're also introducing the male model right now. So we'll, we'll actually have a Mr. Kenya wow. you know, after, really? after a very long time. Mm -hmm. So um, that's another one to, to, to watch out for. And then we also have uh, um, some more stories. So we can actually start in here. Let's look at... Uh, at the cutout pages, you That's see these are some of the. <laughs> That's a favorite. Some of the, yeah, these are some of my favorite because. Um, but here you can see uh, Big Ted dancing here. You see Big Ted is his whole um, bully figure. This was at the um, Daddy Owen's uh, vanity launch, you know, ten, ten, uh, ten years anniversary, mm. which was a great, great success. You know, a lot of artists, um, a lot of Support DJs him. came and supported. Then even you know we saw um, news anchors. Where were you, Mike? Where were you? Uh, I was not around. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. that but but uh, van van um, uh, Vanity is actually a very, 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 um, uh, uh, I would say, it's well done. Mm -hmm. Very well done. Mm -hmm. um, it just shows the consistency that uh, Daddy Owen has, has had over the years. You know, this is the fifth album, you know, and he's already won even um, um, MTV Mamas as the only gospel artist in Africa. Wow. Right? He, he's, he's definitely been very consistent. Yeah, and, and, and the story and the story and, relevant, and, relevant. How, relevant. and how the whole uh, show was um, was arranged was uh, quite a great success, and a lot of people showed up as well. Um, I remember the highlight of it was uh, he has an, um, an an initiative where he he supports artists with a disability. Mm -hmm. There was one DJ called DJ Euphoric who's on a wheelchair, and he says he doesn't have equipment to play. And the uh, artists came together in, in less than half an hour. They had managed to raise over half a million wow. to buy him equipment. You know, that was a very, wow. very um, nice one. And he had all, all artists come on stage, you know, to, to cut uh, the 10th anniversary cake. Mm -hmm. He had uh, his fiance, who I think we're also going to be seeing much inside the past, uh, past today. Yeah, there's actually uh, the story of his fiance on page six. Yes. And she's finally come out. She's uh, known as Farida Wamboi. Yes. And she's speaking out uh, and saying, well, she's been by his side. I must be here for him and support him through it all mm -hmm. because we are in this together. I wish him the best and pray he always stays shining. Are there wedding bells? I guess they are wedding bells, or definitely they are wedding bells, because I, I remember when he was cutting the cake and he had to call her on stage, and he said something that, you know, made us all uh, raise our eyebrows. I wish Stephen Zwander was there. I was, I was in there and we were watching it keenly, mm -hmm. and when he said that, to cut a cake ya kwanza, and then she said pre-wedding, said, no, 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 <laughs> you know, is coming. So, uh, I, I, I think we should be having... Uh, well, she'd be rather quiet about... Are you, aren't you a big fan of... Or a fan I am. At least. I am. Mm -hmm. He's been doing great all this time. I'm very proud of him and his launch. It mm -hmm. was a great success, like you said. I'm so happy so many of the artists went to support him. Mm -hmm. it's, it's become, actually, it's become quite the fraternity nowadays in yes. Kenya. They always show up, support each other, which is very sweet. Exactly. I love it. Exactly. Yeah, okay. but I had no idea about his fiance. Yeah, she's very pretty. Much oh yeah. Yes. Yes. Get yourself a Her copy of the. Her sentiments are so the sweet. Yeah. Also. Get yourself a copy of the Pulse. There's uh, all that you'll get to see her as well. Mm -hmm. And there's also a story uh, still about Daddy Owen, mm -hmm. United by Vanity. That's a special feature, mm -hmm. which uh, we want you to get yourselves. A bit. There's also, um, on page 12, KTN's news channel launch at the tribe. Oh, some uh, beautiful uh, pictures here. Some pictorials there of mm -hmm. what Mike, is going on. Mike, are you? These are the tribe. No, me and Mike were doing selfies by the we pool. We were busy with so, so you wouldn't see us in the paper. <laughs> <laughs>
And so Lo, I think, was holding things that he may not have wanted to come out on pictures. Ah! <laughs> but you said them aside. Or you take your photo. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, so that's what we have for you on the past. Let's uh, now look at the Nairobi. And let's get yourself a... Not yep. even to forget, um, mm -hmm. just before we, 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 we close in the past, mm -hmm. um, uh, the past has also done a, a very nice uh, feature about, uh, you know, so, so Saudi Solar in South Africa. Oh, uh, yes. In Durban, yes. South Africa. Mm -hmm. For the Mama, Mama. Mama they've been nominated for Best Group category. Um, uh, and we're hoping that they... This they one needs to come home. Yeah, this, this, this time they scoop it. They've, they've had quite a number of nominations where they did yes. uh, yes. clinch it. They just came back from the BET. Yeah. Yeah, and now um, uh, Mama, so we really hope, uh, we wish them all the best um, tomorrow. Okay. okay. Yeah. All the best, I want to soul and bring the coffee home. Mm -hmm. Yeah, we are your fans and we are looking forward to that. On to the Nairobian this morning. Mm -hmm. And uh, there is, well, on the front page, Kenyan girl in sex slavery. I think mm -hmm. that's one of the main stories in the Nairobian, right? Yes. Um, uh, this is a story that leaked um, a few days ago um, on the internet. About there's a, there's a clip doing around a four-minute clip of a of a, of a black lady um, um, in a pornography with uh, two two white men mm -hmm. whose faces were were not visible. Mm -hmm. But uh, if you imagine this this form video was actually sent to one of our friends in Kenya. So you know there's a a speculation that uh, there's uh, slavery um, uh, for for sex. You know, some some guys are being lowered um, into foreign countries and and then forced into sexual slavery. Mm -hmm. um, she happened to be a Kenyan, and you know, uh, but people have been speaking about it. And uh, right now, I think uh, the government or uh, the, its agencies are are on it just to find out if uh, it's true. Because you know. Uh, it looked like she was crying and it looked like she was actually being molested because mm -hmm. uh, they kept slapping her. Um, and now um, uh, her friend um, Cynthia Kamati is actually speaking on, on this matter and, and saying how she got uh, to be tagged on the video um, from a known person mm -hmm. and then realized that this is a friend of hers who had uh, um, got into a relationship with a, with a foreign man gone and then um, they, they lost contact. And this oh, is the yeah. next time that uh, he's seeing... Uh, she's seeing this this, uh, this this story. This story. I think yes. it's, it's it's a story that is worth your read. Uh, so please make sure you get yourself a copy of uh, Nairobian. But before we finish, mm -hmm. there is uh, City News on page nine. Mm -hmm. The short skirt, a real low in my life, and this is Linda. Oh, yeah, for the first Linda time. Linda um, the no. famous policewoman, in case you don't know who Linda Okello is, remember a picture that was going round with a policewoman holding her cell phone and let's just say... Um, a traffic policewoman who looked... Who was stopping traffic. <laughs> yes, she was, was stopping traffic. <laughs> bumper, yeah. bumper. Yeah, so Linda Okello... <laughs> Linda Okello comes and speaks <laughs> about, you know, speaks about the short uh, skirt. You know, it happened about one year ago. Mm. She was in a lot of uh, trauma, you know. And uh, now she comes it and speaks about uh, the effect of, uh, of, what of that photo, of what yeah. happened. Um, Although I wouldn't say her skirt was short. I think it was more... Tight. Tight than short. Well, it's not tight. It's just her body. No, it was well, tight. Yeah, I, I don't, I don't, it's her body. Her body is <laughs> tight. <laughs> it's it's tight. tight. It's, it's tight. tight. It's tight. It's tight. So anyway, Linda Okello has come out to say her lows in her life after yeah. this picture went round. And this is a story that you'd also like to read. Yeah, because she comes out and talks about uh, her lows, you know, when she lost her first daughter. Mm. Um, and uh, you know, and especially this time when she she was she got a, a little bit tra traumatized, mm -hmm. and now she also says she's back to school. She's in uni. Wow. Good yes. Time. And and then yeah. normally I don't know what it is, but uh, there's normally a huge transformation when you look at a police officer. Yeah. In uniform and yeah. not in uniform. There's but, a picture but, of her. But for her, for her, I think the transformation is constant. <laughs> uh, <laughs> <laughs> and I like it. And you know, um, uh, David Odongo even goes to ask her if uh, she dates uh, some of the pedestrians. She she stops and well, I guess people should just grab a coffee and find out. Grab yourself a coffee. You should get yourself arrested. Where she is policing and uh, yeah, and it could be against the law. And be arrested. <laughs> <laughs> that get All right, guys, we need to summarize and finish. Welcome. Solo, what are you up to over the weekend? Well, um, I know. The next weekend, uh, we'll, we have the aftermath of Obama, but this weekend, <laughs> we're doing, you know, we're doing it Rasta. Okay. Me and DJ Jim. No wonder he has already started. <laughs> 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 that was so Friday. Yeah. 
you said you where are we going? Two five four. Yeah? Two five four. We're going to two five four. Ah, two five four. What is two five four? Talonch. Okay. Yeah. So eighteen twenty four, two five four. Which one is Kidero <laughs> going after the other one as well? <laughs> no, Kidero went for eighteen twenty four. Where 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 the host Sunday schools on Sunday. Mm. Ah. Okay. Yeah. And he didn't and even know the name. And as we're going to as we're going to two five four. Two five four. Yeah. Oh Shin, what are you up to? I I know it. Eid, thank you, thank you. Eid Mubarak. Eid Mubarak. Eid Mubarak. Eid Mubarak. Muslimin, everybody. Yeah. Where are we eating? At my house, it's coming. Wow, you're coming. Taja. 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 Himeni amet kuja. Chamani. So that's all you do for the weekend. That's your main highlight. Where? It's been a long week. It's been okay. a long couple yeah. of weeks. Solo and I, since we've been invited now to come, we shall yes, definitely have a little time. My mom wants to meet you so much. Oh, she does? Yeah, she thinks you're a lovely, lovely guy. Oh, thank you, mom. <laughs> <laughs> and I love food, so tell her to cook in plenty. We'll come hungry. Um, yeah. She'll make you fat. Mm. Are you ready? Uh, well, for a weekend, I think. <laughs> this is what Sophia and I call cheat days. So it can be the cheat days. It can be the day that oh, I just come so. Yeah. Looking That's forward funny. to that. Thank you guys for joining us right here on Morning Express. We're going to take a short break. DJ Genius is going to give us some tracks. And after that, we still have our Friday chat coming up.